Jack. Ah, are you ready to talk? Jack's right. We've got to do this on our own. It was that stupid dog. We'll have to move them on. When? Before we have the police on our backs. I'll go and make some arrangements, and you, you make sure those brats don't send any more signals. First he wants up the signal, and he don't. I wish you'd make up his mind. What's the use? We can't escape from here anyway. We stand more chance if we're free, idiot. So get over here and give me a hand. I'm not an idiot. I'm Prince Paul of Baronia. If you want to go out to be king, you better hurry up and untie me. Mm, I think I've got it. Wait. No more messages for you lot. You won't get away with this. My friends will get help. They'll come back for us. Yeah. But you won't be here, will you? Dad! Dad! Thaddeus! What? Where are you going? I'm heading west, to the border. How do you know that's west? Charlotte, I'm an explorer. I have a nose for directions. That's west. Oh. Yeah, well, if you'd been through what I've been through, you'd have lost your sense of direction, too. You don't believe all this, do you? What, about a kidnapped prince of Moronia, a hand-kissing foreigner, your Mike, the troublemaker, and a Pekingese guard dog? You don't. You don't believe us. Madam, I wouldn't believe you if you told me I had a nose on my face. As for this lot and their crazy father... But you must! You've got to go and get help and rescue them. I'll tell you what I've got to do. I've got to get back to work and stop wasting my time. You can't. You ought to be ashamed. Me? Yes, you. These poor kids can't help it with the father like they've got. But you, you should know better. I'll see myself out. What do we do now? I'll make cocoa. I don't want a cocoa. I want to rescue Mike. How can we rescue him? No one believes us and we can't fight those two men and that dog on our own. We could use a secret tunnel at Spiggy Holes and get into the monastery that way. The tide's in. Nice try, Jack. If we had the time, we could dig our own tunnel, like in the old war movies. Thanks, Ruby. A tunnel! That's it! Laura, it would take months to dig a tunnel. No, no. There's already one. I just remembered. What are you talking about? Dad told me about it. There's supposed to be a tunnel from our house to the old monastery. The smugglers used it as an escape route. Where is it? I don't know. We never found it. Those old books of Dad about spiggy holes. There could be something in there. Aren't we a bit exposed? It's a risk worth taking. We'll make better time this way. How far have we got to go? About ten miles, I think. What? We'll never make it. We'll stop soon. We'll wait until dark before crossing the border. It'll be safer. Come on. Nothing about secret tunnels in here. 
Maybe it was just one of Dad's stories. It wasn't. He wouldn't make up a thing like that. Should we go through it again? Maybe we missed something. It's a waste of time. If you were going to build a secret tunnel, you wouldn't write about it in a book, would you? I suppose not. So where's the best place for a secret tunnel? In the most unlikely place. I think I'll make us some cocoa. Why don't you get some firewood? I'd light a fire in here. Don't bother. Smoke's all over the place. The chimney's blocked. It can't be. When I was having my nap in here, there was a terrible draught. Thought I'd left the window open. The chimney! The old fireplace! The marathon. I never thanked you for rescuing me. No. Forget it. It was my fault for getting into this mess in the first place. <sighs> well, we all make mistakes sometimes, Charlie. My dad used to call me that. <laughs> no wonder you grew up to be a tomboy. You got a problem with that? Well? Get some rest. <sighs> We're just like babes in a wood. Don't call me babe. <clears throat> oh. Can you find anything, Jack? Oh, I think there's something. It is something. Jack! Oh! This is it! It's a secret tunnel! Jack, wait for me! It's no use. My fingers are too tired. It's coming. Give it one more try. That's it. That's it. Well done. But what do we do now? I'm ready to bring the cargo over to you now. Right now. Good. We'll be there as soon as we can. That's settled. We have another safe house. Go and get them. Shouldn't we wait till tonight? No, we can't wait. We'll have the police here any minute. We'll have to risk travelling by daylight. Go and get the brats. Listen. What's that? Me picking the lock. No, listen. What is it? Rats. Look, it's moving. Surprise, surprise. Jack! Right, you two. I don't know. The door was locked, the windows was boarded up. They just vanished into thin air.
It's a tunnel. How do they find out about that? I give you three guesses. Those interfering brats from people. For the last time, tell me where my son is. And I'm telling you, we don't know. This man is Thaddeus Arnold, the famous explorer, and I'm... Charlotte Clancy, photojournalist. Do you think I'm stupid? Incredibly. Take them away. Make them talk. I don't care how you do it, just make them talk. Just a minute. Just a minute. Is this thing on the internet? Yes. Seize her. Back off. What are you doing? I'm showing you just how stupid you are, Your Highness. Look it up. Scoop magazine. It's all there. Wait. Let her go. If this is a trick... You really have to get this thing upgraded, Your Highness. This isn't the Stone Age anymore. There. The explorer Thaddeus Arnold and photojournalist... Charlotte Clancy. Mr. Arnold. Oh, hi. <laughs> there was some woman looking for you the other day. She found me. Are the kids all right? Uh, who? The kids, my children. Oh, <laughs> them. <laughs> Ruby, has something happened? And where are they? Where are they? Yes, Ruby, where are they? Well, um... We're they're... here, Ruby, we're here. Uh, we did it, Ruby, we did it. We saved the what? What did she say? It's your dad. Let me talk to him. I want to. Dad, you'll never guess. We saved the prince. It's Paula Baronia. And Mike was... Who? Who did she say? Mike. No, no, no. You said a prince. The prince of Baronia. We saved him. What? It's true, Dad. He's a real prince. They found your son. What? Who? Do the police know? No. Then call them. It's all right, Dad. We're safe now. Call the police, Peggy, just in case. We're on our way. Okay, bye. Are you really a prince? Of course. I am His Royal Highness, Prince Paul of Baronia. You may kiss my hand. <laughs> Not unless you wash it first. In fact, you could all do with a good bath. Hey, what's that?
Not me, boss. Oh, we're going to lose it now. Look, oh, it's the engine. We're gonna make it. Yes, we will. As long as Ruby still is on. <laughs> All cocks for them. <laughs> How would you like to be the richest nanny in the world? What do you mean by the richest? Oh yes, dear lady. Anything you want. Hmm. Well? Yes, yes. Nah. I got everything I need. Except perhaps a motor for my scooter. But I'd rather repair that myself than have anything to do with a couple of gangsters like you. No, we'll get nothing from her. We'll drive back and find them. They can't have gone far. There's no petrol. Get the spare can out of the boot. <laughs> we made it! What now? We wait. What for? Until Ruby brings the police. Or Dad gets back. All those two men give up. They'll never give up. Keep an eye on her. What are you doing with a no-good like him? Kidnapping little kids. Money. <laughs> that old thing. Me? I've never had any, but I'm happy. Yeah, because you're stupid. <laughs> Not as stupid as you. <laughs> Me of someone. Yeah? Yeah, really cool guy. Lead guitarist. He went off the rails, but I soon got him straight. Is that right? Well, I used to take piano lessons. Bert! Come here! Stay! What's up? Something moved on that island here. <coughs> I can't see anything. Something move. Now wait here. Bert, come here. Come on. <coughs> what is it? Look, it's them. They are on that island. Get that boat. Hey, you! Oh, Lever, it's the prince we're after. You're so lucky. Us? Why? You've got this island. You're free to roam about and have adventures. Can't you? Of course not. I'm a prince. Everywhere I go, people watch to see how I behave. It's very boring. I'd like to stay here for ages and learn how to rock and roll with your nanny, Ruby. Who told you about that? I told him. Who's that? Fisherman. What? In a motorboat? All right, Prince, all right. I know you're pleased to see me. Ruby, I'm back. Peg? Mike? Laura? Jack? Where have they gone? Where is everybody? Oh, Dad. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Ruby, where are you? Who is it? Shush! It's them. Come on.
Uh, sorry, Mr. Diaz. I am full. Sorry. Come on. All right. To the boat. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. <laughs> My friends, my friends, how can I ever repay you for the safe return of my son? Let him stay with us for the holidays, Your Majesty. Oh, yes, Father, please. It's hard work being a prince. <coughs> no, not you, prince. Only if you repay the favour and invite them back to stay in Baronia. Yes. If we're going to be friends, we'll have to change the dog's name. No, when I am with you, my friends, I am just Paul, not a prince. I'm still not kissing your hand until you've washed it. No, Ruby, I want you to teach me to rock and roll. <laughs> <laughs> Every hero in screen fantasy